My little brother's name is Shiv. I love playing with him a lot. Some of my favorite games are Floor is Lava, um, Tag, and Hide and Seek. I love coding because it's it's very fun and it's very and it's very t happy to see um, that your program is working just like you wanted after um, for all that effort. Artificial intelligence is a way for programs to get intelligent by putting some technology inside it and I think it's pretty friendly. I don't, some people think that it might, you know, like conquer the world or something, but I don't think that because, for example, computers, when they first came out, people thought that computers were going to conquer the world, but they didn't. They just helped humans to do, well, stuff. And I think this is the same for AI. And also, AI is good at what, we're, what we aren't good at, and we are good at what AI isn't to, good at. Uh, in the future, I want to create a new type of AI, or at least a new algorithm in AI. And in the more near future, I'm already in the process of creating a portal where I can discuss and solve some coding and math problems with people with similar interests as me. In programming, I compete with university students and software professionals on different platforms like LeetCode, AdCoder, Geeks for Geeks, etc. I'm an IBM certified AI professional. As a baby, I would say same as other babies, you know, keeping us on toes and okay. whenever his needs are not being fulfilled, showing tantrums, crying. <laughs> yeah, but he was very, very much energetic and uh, he always needs some or other thing. We didn't realize it very early, you know, when we say he was one year old or two year old, uh, we didn't realize anything. Okay. Um, yeah, but he, his concentration level was good. So whenever he's playing with a toy or solving a puzzle or playing with the blocks, yeah. um, he used to do, he used to get involved in too much. So that's one thing we noticed, but we never thought that it's something good or is it going to help him in future that we never pay attention on that. Yeah. Yeah. yeah so for so yeah until he was year four and a half or something yeah. not not even four in fact you know I, 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 until year five we didn't realize he is much different than other he was as normal as except he was more troublesome for us for, you know uh, if you compare if we were comparing with other kids other kids were so helping to their parents so you know I was uh, so go along with their parents he was kind of uh, i know always wanted to do something always you know always on keeping us on the toes uh, yeah. but... terrible twos <laughs> and threes were literally terrible for us you can say uh, but, yeah. yeah but it was good time it yeah, was good time yeah, <laughs> it was it was and he was in year 2 a lockdown at home and he f uh, he started with year 2 mathematics and in 6 months he finished uh, mathematics still year 10 without with, any with, guidance yeah with no guidance or support yeah. from us during lockdown, there was not much that we can do. We cannot go outside. Yeah, and yeah. Um, he used to finish his schoolwork in just 15, 20 minutes or so. Very, very quickly he used to finish. And then we get some time to explore around the house. So he used to do some mischief work around. He broke a lot of things that time. <laughs> yeah. And still he had some time. So how to utilize? So he we gave him laptop. Okay, let's explore what you want to explore. So the mathematics or coding stuff interests him. And it started, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That time he started and he picked it up so, so well.